So, Kayash, how long have you been suffering migraines for? Uh, how many years? Since high school. So, about yes. three or four years. Awesome. And just on average, how many migraines do you get a month? Um, at like, least one. At least one per month, but it can vary to one per week. Oh, good. Okay. And just lately you've had an increase, have you? Yeah. And how many... Months. Yep. For the past month, I've had about once per week. Okay, thank you very much. And you've had the migraine stopper, and we've tried it for three migraines. Tell me what happened. Um, well, the first one, I was a bit... Um, what's the word? Was bit, yeah, I wasn't really expecting it to work, but <laughs> um, it, it was actually... I, I gave it a few pumps, and... Uh, it works. Like it, it, it just it's, the headache just slowly starts dissipating until eventually it's gone altogether. And you know, I, I wouldn't do this while sprinting around, obviously, because it kind of counteracted it. But it works. And it, how long from putting it into your ear and actually pumping it to the migraine going away? How many minutes? Oh, about ten minutes, I think. Yeah. Excellent. And did it turn the migraine off or just reduce it a lot? Um, that time turned it off. Yeah, absolutely. Excellent, yeah. that's great. Um, and have you seen him use the device, Karen? Yes, it was pretty easy, and he, you know, I think it takes a little bit of getting used to doing things with both hands and, and everything. But once you get into it, I, I don't think it could be any easier. And like Kayash, were you surprised it worked? I was surprised and so relieved because yeah. it's it's been interrupting his life. Um, in an ever-increasing way so it, and and the thought of him being on drugs uh, on a permanent basis was um, really upsetting to me I, of course I, did, I, I didn't want to go down that avenue if there was another um, avenue so this is this is fantastic and had Kayash been medicated yes uh, was it like prescription or just like painkillers it was prescription um, we we had tried um, some medication that when you felt the migraine coming on, you, you would use it. Yep. And that was very hit and miss, um, and it was very dependent on how fast he got onto the medication. Um, and, and there was seemed to be a very short window, and then it didn't matter what you did. So if you missed it, it, that was if it? If you missed it, then that was He would that still get it. the migraine? He would still, it didn't matter that he took the, the medication. So that would be him out for, you know, 10 or 12 hours, you know. He would just take himself off to bed, and that was that. And then we were just commencing some um, him being on some permanent medication to try and stop them happening in the first place. I can't tell you whether that worked because we found out about this and came and trialed it, and and, and that's Perfect. yeah. I, mean, that's... I, I can say it does make you extremely tired. What does? The prescription medicine. Yes. Because it slows down your heart rate. It. Uh, yeah. Very. It was only on it for about a week. So. Yeah. So that was noticeable to you? Yeah, absolutely. Did you feel there was any side effects with the migraine stopper? None at all. But it, it seems a bit too good to be true. That's the only <laughs> term I can come up with. But it's seriously, like there's no side effects. There's no, oh, I can make it worse one out of ten times or whatever. It's just, it works. And that's what you get. And there's you no, go on with yeah, your life. There's like, no, you know, there's it's a bit like magic. <laughs> And do you feel, based on the last three, that you've got a solution to manage your migraines now? Absolutely. Excellent. Absolutely. Thank you very much. Nice to meet you again. Thank you. So, what um, is your experience with the migraine stuff? What's it done for you? What's it done for me? Well, it's um, it's made made it easier to turn turn off the pain without taking drugs, which is really good, and also. Um, one of the best things is that it's I'm getting less and less headaches and they're further and further apart. Right, so you have noticed a, a, a reduction in frequency? A definite reduction, yeah. And just in rough terms, before migraine stopper, which I think has been about eight or nine months for you, mm -hmm. um, just in rough terms, how many would you get on average then compared to now? Well, then I would get them... I would, I would be lucky to go a week without having a migraine. Uh, usually at least one, one a week, yep. often more. Whereas now I'm going weeks without, weeks without.
perfect. And you said now, if you wake up with a migraine, you don't panic. What happens when you wake up with a morning migraine now? Well, when I wake up with a migraine now, I use the migraine stopper first off. Yep. And then when I get up and I have a cup of tea and I make sure I have breakfast early, and it's usually gone by that. Perfect. And can you turn off most of your migraines with the stopper? Yes. yes. Perfect. And some people um, miss the prodrome because they wake up with a headache. So how successful is this migraine stopper when you actually have a migraine and you've missed the prodrome? Um, if it's severe migraine, it's not as easy to turn it off. Mm -hmm. but, um, and I, but I still try without taking anything. I, I, I was actually thinking this morning of having to resort to taking a, a tablet. but. Um, I've sort of put it off and now the headache's pretty much gone. So. Yeah, so you had a morning migraine this morning. Yes, I did. So did you wake up with it? Yes. And out of a, a pain scale of 0 to 10, how bad was the pain? Well, it was pretty much a 10, it was a bad one. Yeah. And that's when you applied the therapy? Yes. And how long until you got some relief? Oh, about um, 15, 20 minutes, I got a little bit of relief. Mm -hmm. um, and then by the time an hour, two hours, I could tell that I might get away without taking any. Okay. And that has been the case. Yeah. Perfect. And um, would you recommend the migraine stopper to other people? I certainly would. I have already recommended it to tell friends that I've I've been you know that it's coming out. Yep. And um, they need to try it. Yes. Absolutely. So, uh, in a word, does the migraine stopper stop your migraines? 